In today's video, we are going to be talking about apple cider vinegar and how it can be beneficial for weight loss. Now, before you click away thinking that I'm trying to sell you some miracle cure, <laughs> hear me out. Is apple cider vinegar a cure-all? No, of course not. But it does have some beneficial properties which can enhance your results. And these results are backed up by clinical trials, which I will be referencing throughout this video. So in today's video, I'm going to be telling you why apple cider vinegar can be beneficial for weight loss and how to implement it into your routine for best results. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Kate. I'm a health coach and I post videos on a high fat, nutrient dense way of eating. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Feel free to share and make sure to subscribe. And make sure to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and now TikTok because I share new posts there every single day. The topic of today is apple cider vinegar and weight loss. And look, I know there are a million and one weight loss hacks out there. <laughs> everything from fat burning pills and detox teas to tricks such as eating food on smaller plates. And some of these might work to varying degrees, but others are complete nonsense. So where does apple cider vinegar fall? The truth is, is that apple cider vinegar can be effective for weight loss and the evidence is there to back it up. And incorporating it into your routine could not be easier. So in today's video, we're gonna be talking about why it is beneficial for weight loss and make sure to stick around until the end because I will be telling you how you can add it into your routine for the best results. Why it works. So apple cider vinegar is made from fermented apple juice and you might automatically think that that would mean it's high in sugar, but it's not. The fermentation process breaks down the sugar. So there's next to none left by the time apple cider vinegar is created. Now there are a few reasons why apple cider vinegar can help to support weight loss. But the big one that we're going to focus on today is that it can help you to keep your blood sugar stable, which is absolutely key for weight loss and absolutely key for overall health in general. When our blood sugar spikes and crashes, we experience cravings, specifically for sugar. When our blood sugar is stable, we do not have these cravings. And of course, when we have cravings and cravings for sugar especially, this can lead us to make unhealthy choices. But like I said, this isn't even the main reason why apple cider vinegar is beneficial for weight loss. When you take apple cider vinegar before a meal, it actually helps the cells in your body absorb glucose better. So instead of having a big spike in your blood sugar that requires a lot of insulin, the spike is less significant and less insulin is needed. One study had participants take one and a half tablespoons of apple cider vinegar two minutes before a high carb meal that included a bagel and orange juice. They found that the group that consumed the apple cider vinegar were up to 34% more insulin sensitive an hour after eating compared to the group that consumed the placebo. This meant that their blood sugar was lower and more stable. So beyond helping with cravings, this is why having less blood sugar spikes is ideal for weight loss. It all comes down to insulin. Insulin is known as the fat storage hormone because when insulin is elevated, our bodies are in fat storage mode. This is because high insulin means that there's excess sugar in the blood, ready for our bodies to use for energy. And because our body thinks we have this energy readily available, we do not need to burn stored body fat. So the less insulin that is needed to process a meal, this means that your body can get back to burning fat faster. And because apple cider vinegar helps to control blood sugar, it can help to reverse insulin resistance and type 2 diabetes as well. One study had diabetics take two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar before bed, and this lowered their fasting blood sugar when they woke up by 4%. Now, before we get into how you can use apple cider vinegar to enhance your weight loss results, I'm going to take a quick moment to tell you about today's sponsor, Squarespace. I put out two videos every week here on YouTube. These are free videos that you guys can watch and learn from, and it's thanks to companies like Squarespace that I'm able to do this. So if you're thinking about building a website, maybe for your business or even for personal use, such as you want to start a blog, make sure to check out Squarespace. Their award-winning customizable templates will give your website a polished and professional look while also being highly customizable. You have complete control over colors, fonts, sizing, photos, and more. Their templates are beautiful and professional. 
And one cool feature that's handy for anyone who is working with clients is their scheduling tool. You can utilize multiple calendars, customize payment settings, and set up automatic email and text reminders. Head to squarespace.com forward slash healthcoachkate to start your free trial. And when you love it and decide to launch, use code healthcoachkate to save 10% off your first order. Thank you again to Squarespace for sponsoring this video. How to use it. So how can you use apple cider vinegar? When is the best time to take it? All you have to do is drink one tablespoon of apple cider vinegar diluted in water, one, two, even up to 30 minutes before you eat. And I want to highlight that it's important to dilute it in water, otherwise it can damage your teeth. Some people also like to drink it through a straw. Now, when to take it. So some people will take it before every meal, and some people only meals that are higher in carbohydrates, because those are the macronutrients that spike blood sugar and insulin the most. You can also have it with your meal. So for example, if you're having a salad or even just a salad to start, you can make a salad dressing with apple cider vinegar or any vinegar for that matter. All vinegar actually does have the same effect, but I just recommend apple cider vinegar because it's easier to drink. <laughs> but yeah, like I said, you can make it into a salad dressing or yeah, use it in cooking another way. It does have a bigger impact when you take it before you eat, but taking it with your meal can help as well. Now, another question that I'm frequently asked is, can you use apple cider vinegar capsules or gummies instead? And from what I've seen, these do not have the same effect at all. <laughs> Some even have added sugar, which completely takes away from the benefits. Now, before we wrap up, I just want to reiterate that apple cider vinegar is not a miracle cure. You can't keep eating in the way that made you gain weight and just add apple cider vinegar and expect that to work on its own. Yes, it can help, of course, but it's not going to be enough. It has to be combined with proper diet. And I don't mean a crash diet that's restrictive. I mean a sustainable change to the food you're eating that you can sustain and that will lead to long lasting results. If you guys would like more info on the diet I recommend that doesn't involve tracking calories or macros that I use with my clients, I will link a video up above that you can check out afterwards. But anyways guys, that's all I have for you today. Let me know in the comment section down below if you've used apple cider vinegar in the past or currently and if you found it to be beneficial for weight loss. Let me know down below. I love chatting with you guys and I try to answer all of your questions at least the ones that are posted within a couple of hours of me posting the video. I try to answer as many of those as I can and then try to answer some other ones here and there. But if you post right away, it's pretty likely I will answer you. <laughs> and yeah, your comments really help to support my channel, to support the video, so I appreciate them. <laughs> And before you leave, don't forget to check out today's sponsor, Squarespace. The link will be in the description box down below. If you did enjoy this video, you might also enjoy my video on 10 steps you can take to reverse insulin resistance. I will link it here. If you want to catch up on my most recent upload, you can find it here. And if you want to check out my keto diet and carnivore diet coaching programs, you can find this here. Thanks guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.